With the Xerox High Capacity XLS Vacuum Feeder, you can feed both standard and extra long sheets up to 47.2 inches or 1.2 meters more reliably and at production volumes. The feeder is available in standard or dual configurations, and its top tray, called the XLS tray, can hold up to 700 sheets, ranging in size from 8.2 by 8.2 inches to 13 by 34 inches, and 100 sheets from 34 inches to 47.2 inches. But let's start by loading standard size sheets up to 19.2 inches long in the XLS tray. First, remove any paper from the bypass tray and open the top cover. Open the long side paper guides by pinching the levers and moving away from the center. See how the two front guides will move together? When using standard sheets loaded in the XLS tray, the short side paper guide should be set in an upright position. If it's not, open the storage area at the bottom of the tray by pulling the green tab here, toward you, and sliding the storage area cover all the way to the right. Raise the short side paper guide from the right until it clicks into place. Slide the storage space cover back until the green tab returns to its original position and move the guide to the left to its limit to make it easier to load paper into the tray. One more thing, there's a switch at the end of the outboard long edge paper guide here that needs to be set in the horizontal position before continuing, like so. With the short side paper guide up, the green switch is always in a horizontal position. When it's stowed, the green switch should be vertical. Load 100 to 300 sheets to start. Be sure to lift the lead edge of the paper over the short side paper guide and get it right in there, all the way to the front of the tray. Adjust the two front long side paper guides as well as the rear guide to support the stack. Load additional sheets if needed, as many as 700 total. Close the top cover. You're ready to print. Program the tray for the specific stock that you loaded, either manually or using Predict Print Media Manager, depending on the press. Let's take a closer look at how to load sheets longer than 19.2 inches all the way up to 34 inches. Open the main top cover as well as the cover just to the left. Remove any paper that might be remaining in the tray. With the short side paper guide stowed and the switch in its vertical position, open the long side paper guides to their widest limit. Load about 100 sheets print side up and then adjust the front long side paper guides as well as the rear guide to support the stack. Load additional sheets if needed as many as 700 total. Be sure all the sheets are flush with the front of the tray. Place the large magnetic long side paper guide against the outboard side of the stack and the shorter rear edge paper guide against the back. Close the covers and again, follow the usual steps to program the tray for the specific stock that you loaded. Feeding even longer sheets between 34 inches and 47.2 inches reliably is no problem for this feeder. And since it can hold up to 100 sheets in this range, it's super productive too. Open the main top cover, but before opening the smaller cover to the left, locate the two thumb screws on the XLS access panel and loosen them by turning counterclockwise. You don't have to remove the thumb screws completely, just enough to disengage the XLS access cover. Lift off the access cover and open the left top cover. You'll find the XLS tray extension right here at the end of the unit near the floor. Line up these two tabs with these two slots on the extension tray and tighten down the thumb screws. Just as before, open the long side paper guides, the magnetic long side paper guide, and move the magnetic long side paper guide out of the way if necessary. You're ready to load up to 100 XLS sheets by lifting the front edge of your paper stack as far as possible into the tray until it is flush with the front. 
Adjust the long side paper guides. Place the large magnetic rear edge paper guide into position. Close both covers and watch the bottom plate automatically raise the paper stack to a more horizontal position. Don't forget to program the tray for your specific stock and you're ready for reliable, high volume printing of XLS sheets. The Xerox High Capacity XLS Vacuum Feeder. Feed more accurately and reliably. Extend your application range. See what it can do for you at Xerox.com.